Ready? Yeah. <laughs> you look so beautiful. So beautiful, Thank man. You. No, I it's not. I love it though. You look so beautiful. Thank you. <sighs> Kill me a troll. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, wow. As many people have said, and so many people in this room can attest, it really was love at first sight. For Megan. <laughs> she really knew that one day they would be here and she was right. Watching you guys go from strangers to neighbors with little crushes on each other to friends to finally dating and now today to husband and wife has been so special and I'm so honored to be a part of this day and the best part is this is truly just the beginning for you guys. It seems like just yesterday we were traveling back and forth on that long stretch of highway to see each other every week. Looking back and thinking of all the memories we have already made together brings so much happiness to my heart. The reason I love you would take hours to put from pen to paper, but I would like to say just one of my favorites. I have never met someone that is as loving as you are. The love you have for your friends and family and show me on a daily basis is truly special. You love with your whole heart and I know that will never change. As I have told you many times, there's nothing more comforting than knowing you have someone that loves you unconditionally. Brian, I cannot believe our big day is already here. I have waited my whole life to marry someone as special as you. I am so grateful I got the courage to call you that one night in Duluth. I can't imagine my life without you. We have already created so many special memories together and I cannot wait to create a lifetime more. You have been with me through some of the best and worst moments in my life and supported me through it all. I love you so much, forever and always. Cheers to forever, love Megan Marie. Ever since I met you, I knew I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you. My whole life, I've been lucky enough to be surrounded by many examples of true love. Ever since I was younger, I hoped and prayed I would find someone who loves me like you do. You have exceeded all of my expectations. As I stand here today, ready to take you as my wife, I feel like the luckiest man in the world. Every day I wonder what I did to deserve someone like you in my life. You are the most loving, kind, beautiful person I have ever met. As you know, I can be indecisive at times, but with you, I have never been more sure. You are truly my best friend, and there is no one I'd rather go through life with, with than you. I will never forget the moment I knew you were the one I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. We were walking on the old Sierra Bridge, and as we walked along that snowy trail, I had a moment of realization that my future was right in front of me, and that future was you.
It was an exciting time when Megan chose the University of North Dakota for college. My mom strongly encouraged Megan to join a sorority. <laughs> Megan was hesitant, but she and Natalie decided to pledge. When I heard Megan was pledging, my first thought was, please don't meet a frat boy. Ready? Wow. You well, she fun. met a frat boy named Ryan. It's been a joy for Stephanie and I getting to know Ryan. He fits in great with our entire family. I love the way he treats Megan. As a dad, you want your daughter to find someone who makes her happy and who treats her well. And we are thrilled he is part of our family. Ryan and Megan met in college, but didn't actually start hanging out as more than friends until after we graduated. Ryan and I were living in a townhouse in Fargo, and Megan was in the cities at the time, and all of a sudden, Ryan started making these trips to visit friends from college <laughs> down in the cities. At least that's what he said. But then these trips started happening more frequently, and I was kind of getting upset because Ryan's been my partner in crime for years now. And I'm like, who's this other guy stealing Ryan away from me? What does he have that I don't? But Ryan relieved all my fears and let me know he was actually talking and hanging out with a girl, Megan, which is a big relief. As we start our lives together as husband and wife, I vow to always be faithful to you, always be honest and patient, always make time for you, always put our family first, Always stand by you during good times and bad, sickness and health. And lastly, I vow to always support you when another Minnesota sports team disappoints you. <laughs> I vow to always make you laugh and smile. I vow to continue growing, going on new adventures. I vow to always be there for you and at your side through the good times and the bad. I vow to support you and inspire you. I vow to grow with you. I vow to always send you dog pictures of Tucker and eventually kid pictures. <laughs> I vow to be the best version of myself and husband to you. And most importantly, I vow to always love you with all my heart and all that I have. I love you to the moon and back, Megan Marie, and I'm so happy to call you my wife. Aww.